BP and the government of Senegal cannot agree, so BP is out. This article is from the Rig Zone website from Bloomberg, Katrina Hoji on Monday, November 27th, titled BP exits Senegal gas field over disagreement with government. She leads in, BP exited one of its gas fields in Senegal earlier this month because of a disagreement over the use of the commodity, the uh, Senegalese government said. While BP, while BP sought to export the gas from the Yakar Taranga natural gas field, Senegal wanted it for domestic use to fire power plants. Minister of Oil and Energy Antoine Felix Deomi said in parliamentary on Sunday or Saturday, excuse me. He says, quote, we didn't agree with BP on the daily production capacity on the commercial strategy or on the date of the first gas delivery, Deomi said. Quote continues, BP favored exports while we want to develop the gas for the domestic market. Senegal sees uh, Yakar Taranga, formerly operated by BP, as crucial for its gas to power strategy to help increase electrification in the West African nation and lower fuel prices. BP left its stake without any financial comp compensation, Naomi says. Meanwhile, the Dallas based Cosmos Energy LLC increased its stake in the oil field project to 90%. From 30%. State owned Petrosen plans to eventually take a majority stake in the field. Senegal wants to accelerate development in the, at the site to deliver gas by 2026 compared to BP's earlier target of 2028, Deomi said. Senegal can't wait that long, he says. A spokesman for BP didn't respond to telephone calls or a text message seeking comment that was outside of business hours. Yakar Taranga, located off the coast of Senegal, holds a total of about 25 trillion, with a T, cubic feet of gas. Senegal is currently looking for a third partner to take a 34% stake um, by the production phase. Are you that partner? What do you think of BP leaving? Um, of course, this is just from the Senegalese government. BP had no comment. What do you think? Are they making a mistake by not coming to terms with the government? Or uh, are they better off uh, looking elsewhere? Please let me know your thoughts in the comments. A link to this article and more is in the description. If you like what you heard, then please don't forget to like and subscribe so you can continue to get the energy science, industry, and regulatory needs that you need for your work or your investments in energy. And remember, with science in our hands, fossils at our feet, knowledge in our heads, and God at the helm, the future is ours to build.